A social media storm erupted on Sunday when two girls were stopped from boarding a United Airlines flight because they were wearing leggings. The girls were flying as guests of employees, and thus were subject to the company's dress code. But it is not the first time leggings or yoga pants have caused controversy in the United States. Both types of tight-fitting trousers, which have become increasingly popular leisure wear, have become the tropic of hot debate in recent years. For many, they are simply a comfy alternative to jeans. For others, their form-hugging material makes them overly revealing or even obscene. Last October, a man in the U.S. state of Rhode Island sent a letter to his local newspaper, calling for women over 20 to stop wearing them. Like the mini skirt, yoga pants can be adorable on children and young women who have the benefit of nature's blessing of youth. However, on mature, adult women there is something bizarre and disturbing about the appearance they make in public, wrote Alan Sorrentino. It sparked a yoga pants protest. Hundreds of women of all ages responded by walking through the town of Barrington wearing leggings. Flight attendant and author Heather Poole said, on Twitter, that airlines often have dress codes for staff traveling for free, as they are seen as representing the company. Men have a dress code too. This is about being too casual. We can't wear flip-flops or shorts either. United Airlines has since clarified that regular passengers are not subject to the same leggings ban as the girls on Sunday's flight. But the dress code, which applies to staff and their relatives traveling on special passes, states a ban on form-fitting lycra, spandex tops, pants and dresses, among various other restrictions. The incident happened on a flight from Denver to Minneapolis on Sunday morning. Activist Shannon Watts said. United said the girls were traveling on a special pass, for employees and their guests, which has a dress code. It has since clarified that all regular, paying customers are welcome to wear leggings. The girls were United Pass travelers, which are tickets for company employees or eligible dependents, it explained in a Twitter exchange on the issue. United Pass travelers are eligible for free or heavily discounted air travel. The dress code for pass holders states they should not wear foam fitting lycra, spandex tops, pants and dresses, among various other stipulations, including no exposed midriffs, no mini skirts and no flip-flops.